Climate change has shot back into the global consciousness as of late, with millions of young protesters taking to the streets around the world to make their voices heard. But if that didn't catch your attention, this might. New data from the World Meteorological Organization shows the five-year period from 2014 to 2019 saw the warmest global temperatures ever recorded. Our Eason Jin reports. Published on the eve of key talks in New York on the sidelines of the UN General Assembly, the World Meteorological Organization has published its latest data on climate change. Shocked by what it contains, weather experts have expressed serious concerns about the latest assessment. According to WMO's data, the five year period from 2014 to 2019 was not only the warmest on record, but it also led to a significant rise in sea levels. While the average rate of sea level rise was 3.2 millimeters a year from 1993 to 2019, the average from 2014 to 2019 had shot up to 5 millimeters. The 10 year period from 2007 to 2016 saw an average of roughly 4 millimeters a year. The report also indicates global warming affects the world's oceans the most, with more than 90 percent of the excess heat caused by climate change soaked up by the ocean. Analysis showed 2018 had the highest ocean heat content values on record. Experts attributed the changes to carbon dioxide emissions hitting new highs over the same period. Data shows carbon emissions were up 20 percent compared with the previous five years. The release of the data coincides with the special U.N. summit on climate change, which takes place in New York on Monday local time. A number of political leaders will attend the one-day event, which according to U.N. Secretary General Antonio Guterres, is designed to be about action, not empty pledges. Greta Thunberg and other youth activists who have been marching on the streets of New York will be there to call for action. In addition, about 60 heads of states are also expected to join, with countries expected to announce new plans to slash emissions and set up new multi-nation environmental protection initiatives. Lee Seung-jae, Arirang News.